Hey, what's up, guys? So here we are. Uh, it is uh, our actually it's, it's our first cooking show. Anyway, so today I'm gonna show you guys how to make homemade tortillas. And the other ones that I've seen um, on YouTube, they say what you need, which is the masa and the water and maybe the flour. But there's actually more that you need. What we're gonna need, obviously, is the water, and then you're gonna need the masa, and then you're gonna need the flour, the salt, the tortilla maker. Now, there's a big process with this. I've tried, when you make the tortillas, you actually need a specific bag. I've tried aluminum, Ziploc bags, I've tried like different types of plastics, and yeah, so you need a specific one. And then a tortilla warmer. Now, huge tip. After you cook the, the tortillas, you're gonna put the tortillas in here, but you have to put about a two, maybe three pieces of napkins, or napkins, in here to absorb all the water, because if not, your tortillas will get uh, kind of soggy. Now, the bag that you're gonna need for the, to make the tortillas, it's that thin little bag that you get at your local grocery store. It's the one where you put your fruits and vegetables. But yeah, this is the bag that you gotta use. Why? Because everything else will stick to this, and this will make it your life so much easier. Trust me. All right, so let's get to it. So the first thing that we're gonna do, now that you've seen everything that we're gonna need. All right, so we're gonna need four cups of the masa. We're going to need one cup of flour. All right, so now that we have the flour, you got a little bit of salt. Now mind you, this is four cups of, of masa with one cup of flour. So the first thing you wanna do is mix it all up. And uh, the reason why we add the flour uh, to make the tortillas a little bit softer Try this recipe a few times. I this is actually the third or fourth time that I modified it, uh, and I think I got it right. So last time they came out amazing. So like I said, the first thing you want to do is mix everything together, and it's gonna be delicious. It's gonna be amazing. It's gonna be delicious. So for this recipe, like I said, I like to put almost four, like three and three quarters, because. Um, you want to get the consistency of Play-Doh, um, like that fresh Play-Doh, the one that you just bought from the store. You open it up and it's really smooth and soft. Not that, you know, two month Play-Doh that's kind of dried out, it's hard, and that's the consistency you're going for. All right, so now that we have everything uh, inside, we're gonna start mixing. And first you wanna make sure all the water gets everywhere. If you need to add a little bit more, you're fine. Add just a little bit more. So if you can see now, the consistency that we're going for. I'm coming off the, off the edges. A few more minutes of this. And we're ready to rock and roll. And there it is. Your masa is ready. The reason why you have to use uh, this bag is because when you get your your tortillas ready, you need this. Why? So you can actually um, press them and then peel them off and, and get them ready to cook. All right, so you wanna start heating up your comal or uh, where you're gonna cook your tortillas because as you get going, once you get going, you don't wanna stop and you don't wanna wait for it to. So now, after you made it, you know, after you cut it, so it can open up like this, see, perfect. Just slice it down the middle with, an, with a scissors. And voila, there it is. So, remember how I mentioned that you want to have a little bowl with water? And it's to keep your hands from getting the, from getting the masa stuck to, your, uh, stuck to your hands. Now you're asking, why am I doing these first? Well, because once you start pressing them, 
you want to start going. And you want to get a few ready to go. So, the reason why I'm making the tortillas, um, my girlfriend actually made um, beans last night. So they're gonna go perfect with the beans. We also got some cheese, so if you guys wanna make some ches uh, quesadillas. Um, another great dish that uh, we like to do is uh, sopes. Uh, but that, I'll make another day. Um, it's a little bit lengthy of a process, but so delicious. On, our, on one of our next videos, or upcoming videos, I'll show you guys how to make sopes. So see how it's sticking to your hands? So, a little bit. Now, no, my tortillas are not perfect. They're not, you know, they don't have to be these perfect circles or perfect rounds or spheres. Um, now that we've got the tortilla on here, cover it with the plastic. Quick pat down, press it down. It's a slight push, not too much pressure. Just enough. And then voila, there it is. Perfect tortilla. And this is why you use this plastic because it just slides off. And there it is. So let me make this batch. And there it is guys, perfect tortillas, every time. Now, when I did this with aluminum and Ziploc bags, uh, it, was, it was a mess. And there it again, this is what you're looking for. There it is. And with this plastic, easy peasy. And this is what they're supposed to look like. All right, so here it is, guys. Here is the last set. These are the last of the tortillas that I'm that I gotta make today. Oh, there we go. And there it is. So again, they're not perfect, but hey, they're all right. Look at that. And this is your final product. See how they're steamy? And this is what I mean, the condensation of the water. That's why you have the napkins in there to absorb all of that. See that? That's why you need the napkins in there to absorb all the water, all the steam. Hey guys. All right, thank you for watching my tutorial on how to make tortillas. In case you guys have any questions, by all means, please let me know um, if you have any suggestions of my video, how I can improve on making better. By all means, please uh, let me know. If you can, please hit the like and subscribe button. Uh, my next tutorial will be uh, teriyaki chicken, um, and yeah, and I'll have that. Um, I'll have that next. So, uh, thank you to our sponsors for what we don't. I thought we had sponsors. Okay, well, apparently I'm being told that uh, we don't have sponsors yet, so. Uh, so, thank you for watching my tutorial on how to make tortillas. In case you guys have any questions, by all means, please message me. Uh, ask me questions at the bottom. I will do my best to get back to you guys. Um, and, yeah. Mm, they are so freaking delicious. So, any questions you have, all by all means, let me know. And y'all, have a good day. Eh? Um, thank you to all our sponsors. What? What do you mean we don't have sponsors? Then who's paying for this? Out of pocket? Man.